Hi guys, this is Dan from DanChristian.net and this is the first in a series of videos on how to play the saxophone. This is BC101 Setup. So guys, this is without a doubt the most important part of setting up your saxophone well and getting that sound that you really want. The mouthpiece is in three parts. The mouthpiece itself, the ligature, and the reed. Now, there are lots of different types of ligatures, mouthpieces, and reeds, but I'm not going to go into them here. If you want some choices, some options, then go to my website at danchristian.net. There's lots of choice there, and, and various other websites around on the web. So, without further ado, let's get started on setting up the mouthpiece. So, what I always do is take the mouthpiece in my left hand, and I place the ligature on next. Fat end first. Now, the reason that's important is the number of times I've seen students and myself put that on first, not put that on first, put the reed over and then go and end up splitting the reed in half. Well, I can't begin to tell you the number of times that's happened. So, ligature on first, or just add up with your finger and thumb, put the reed in, butt end first. Now, this part is critical. I'm just going to straighten that up. Make sure the reed's nice and straight, so it vibrates properly. Now I'm going to push the reed up. Now this is just a rule of thumb, but a good starting point is to try and get the reed even with the top of the mouthpiece. Or maybe if you can just see the slightest hairline crack between the mouthpiece and the reed, that's also quite good. You can make sure that the reed is, well check that the reed is straight by looking at the bottom here. You'll see a little bit of a semicircle at the bottom of the mouthpiece. Just check that it's all level. The more level it is, the better the vibrations will be, and well, the better you'll sound. Make sure that's all lined up. Take the screw, or probably screws in your case, tighten them up. If you have two screws here, make the back one really tight, and then just finger tighten the upper screw. There we go, that's tight now, and we're ready to make our first sound. So guys, when you open up your saxophone case, you'll be faced with something that looks like this. The saxophone really has three main parts. The body of the saxophone, the crook, and your wonderfully assembled mouthpiece. Firstly, I'm going to stand the body of the saxophone up on a flat surface. I don't want to be dropping this, so make sure it's on a flat surface, guys. I'm going to take my crook and I'm going to pop it into the top of the saxophone like so. They can be a little bit stiff, don't worry about that, it's perfectly normal. Make sure that the screw is loose on the neck and make sure that you don't grab onto the octave lever. You can bend that quite easily. I'm going to now tighten up the screw on the crook, take my assembled mouthpiece and just like as if you're riding a motorbike, rev or screw on the mouthpiece like so. Just one other thing guys, remember that there's two thumb rests on the saxophone. There's one for your left hand thumb here, and one for your right hand thumb here. Also there's a holding pin for the strap, very very important. So thanks for watching and please join me in the next video where we'll be talking about how to make your first sound.